So at this point, TikTok is just pretty much known for having some of the most idiotic stuff on, on all of, apparently I can't speak on all of the internet. Like at this point, TikTok has pretty much become the laughing stock of the entire internet. And stuff like what I'm about to show you today is exactly why. Because when I heard about this a few days ago, it just left me utterly bewildered and, and just in shock, astonished, amazed, but in the worst way possible, gobsmacked, all those type of adjectives. So with that being said, the guy that you're seeing on the screen right now is Cameron Heron. And in 2018, Cameron was street racing somebody when he hit a mother and her daughter. And believe it or not, people on TikTok are actually defending this guy and saying he should be released from prison. They even gave him the nickname, the cute killer. And like, if you type in his name on TikTok, the hashtag Cameron Heron has almost 2 billion views. And believe it or not, this guy has actual stan accounts and fan pages on TikTok. Like this guy's whole account is literally just fan cams of a so with that being said, back in April, Cameron was sentenced to 24 years in prison, and I believe that's when this whole situation kind of blew up, and a lot of people on TikTok are saying his sentence should be reduced, and not for like a legitimate reason, like maybe he got framed, or maybe they just gave him too harsh of a sentence, or you know, any type of real logical reason. People are saying his sentence should be reduced, and he should be let out of prison because he's cute. Like some people on TikTok are going around commenting hashtag justice for Cameron, and Heron as if he literally didn't end the life of two people. I'm not sure what type of justice he really needs besides, you know, being in prison. So with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and play you guys a couple Cameron Heron fan cams. And these are videos that have like millions of views and hundreds of thousands of likes on TikTok. It's insanity. Stuff like this is exactly why Trump should have banned TikTok when he had the chance. What happened to that? Literally like a year ago, everybody was talking about how Trump was about to ban TikTok. And then he just never did that. We could have avoided all of this. We could have avoided this whole situation. There would not be killer fan cams if Donald Trump just got the job done and banned TikTok. So with that being said, let me know what you guys think about this whole situation down in the comments. And with that being said, that's where I'm going to wrap up this video. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you're brand new to the channel. As as always, you can follow me on Twitter and TikTok at RelaxYT. And other than that, I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm out.